Hi friends, I am Purva and today we will discuss the following question. In the following, find the coordinates of the foot of the perpendicular drawn from the origin. 3y plus 4z minus 6 is equal to 0. Let us begin with the solution now. Now we are given equation of the plane is three y plus four z minus six is equal to zero or we can write this as three y plus four z is equal to six. Let the coordinates of the foot of the perpendicular of point P from origin to the plane B x1, y1, z1 then the direction ratios of the line OPR x1, y1 and z1 Writing the equation of the plane in normal form we get three y upon five plus four z upon five is equal to six upon 5. Now this is the equation of the plane. So writing this equation of the plane in normal form we get 3 y upon 5 plus 4 z upon 5 is equal to 6 upon 5 where we have this 5 is equal to under root of coefficient of x whole square that is 0 square plus coefficient of y whole square that is 3 square plus coefficient of z whole square that is 4 square. Now this equation is of the form Lx plus My plus Nz is equal to D which is the Cartesian equation of plane in normal form. Now here we have L, comma M, comma N are the direction cosines of the normal and D is the distance of the plane from origin. So comparing these two equations we can say here 0, comma 3 upon 5 comma 4 upon 5 are the direction cosines of the line OP. Now since the direction cosines and the direction ratios of a line are proportional we have x1 upon 0 is equal to y1 upon 3 upon 5 is equal to z1 upon 4 upon 5 is equal to some constant K. Here x1, y1 and z1 are the direction ratios and 0, 3 upon 5 and 4 upon 5 are the direction cosines. That is we have x1 is equal to 0, y1 is equal to 3k upon 5 and z1 is equal to 4k upon 5. Now substituting these values In the equation of the plane we get three 
3 into 3k upon 5 plus 4 into 4k upon 5 is equal to 6. This implies 9k plus 16k is equal to 30 which implies 25k is equal to 30 and this further implies k is equal to 6 upon 5. Now putting this value of k in 1 we get x1 is equal to 0, y1 is equal to 3 upon 5 into 6 upon 5, which is equal to 18 upon 25, and z1 is equal to 4 upon 5 into 6 upon 5, which is equal to 24 upon 25. Thus, the coordinates of the foot of the perpendicular are zero comma eighteen upon twenty five comma twenty four upon twenty five. So we have got our answer as zero comma eighteen upon twenty five comma twenty four upon twenty five. Hope you have understood the solution. Bye and take care.